Hi there, I'm here to recommend some material for our MOOC. My name is Jan Distelmeier and to prevent an endless and probably boring lecture on all the books, films and games that has been important to me, I concentrate here on some basics, maybe just five minutes uh, concerning first film and second digital media. And I try to offer just six basic works that I can recommend here as starting points. The first book um, the classical Hollywood cinema, um, film style and mode of production to 1960. It is uh, written by uh, David Baldwell, Janet Steig and Kristen Thompson in 1985. A very influential and important book to understand how film stories has been told in a classical way. So about the narrational and technical developments in Hollywood from 1917 till 1960. This is a classic itself. And although I have some doubts about the neo formalistic approach that links certain narrational devices to certain effects on the audience, I recommend it here as a fundamental work to understand how stories has been told in a way that we used to call classical today. The second book uh, has been written by André Bazin, one of the most important film critiques and theorists of the 1940s and 50s in Europe. Uh, it has been um, published first in 1975, uh, Qu'est-ce que c'est le cinéma, in French. Um, the English version, uh, the newest English version, was edited by Dudley Andrew and is called What Cinema Is. I think it was published in 2010. This is the German version, uh, Was ist Film, um, published in 2004 by my colleague Robert Fischer. It is a wonderful book. Um, and an important source to understand film as an art form in its own right. And I recommend it here especially because Bazin shows the connections and differences between film and other art forms, like for instance photography, uh, theatre and painting. A movie, if you want to see a movie that explores at an early stage of film history all the uh, aesthetical and narrational options film has to offer, um, you have, in fact, to see Giga Vertov's The Man with a Moving Camera, produced in 1929, a marvelous film and one of the early efforts of artistic research and theory as practice. The next book I would like to recommend here is Lev Malevich's uh, Language of New Media, a groundbreaking study uh, from 2002 um, on principles, policies and aesthetics of digital media. I think very helpful for questions of transmedia storytelling is Malevich's concept of transcoding, which describes the interdependency between digital media and pre- or non-digital culture, and especially the notion and the idea of a database aesthetics seems to me quite interesting for transmedia storytelling projects. The next two books um, give important insights in the field of computer games and game studies. Uh, first, a uh, video game theory reader published by Marc J.P. Wolf and Bernard Perron in, I think, 2003. And this is Screenplay Cinema Video Games Interfaces, um, published by Jeff King and Tanya Chivinska in 2002. Uh, the Video Game Theory Reader is an instructive overview about concepts of game studies and of the computer game um, as a new medium with special opportunities of developing stories or worlds, building worlds and uh, involving audiences, so users. Uh, Bernard Perron's chapter of the example of uh, interactive movies could be of special interest for you. And last but not least, uh, screenplay Cinema Video Games Interfaces um, offer studies of the transmedia exchange between film and computer games. So, um, from principal ideas to case studies. That is um, all for me for the moment, and I hope uh, these recommendations will help you uh, developing your own research projects in the field of transmedia storytelling. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs>